what are you doing with those starfish in Tumbiani? Malume, the water of the ocean are what gives them life. They will die if they are not returned. But how can you return them all when there are so many along the beach? Do you think that you can actually make a difference? I just made a big difference to that one. Welcome everyone to the Starfish Gala 2021. I hope that you and your loved ones are safe and healthy and thank you so much for joining us for this very important cause. My name is Candace Behrens. I'm excited to be here tonight. It is going to be a fun evening. We have great entertainment lined up for you and we are going to do good in the world tonight. Last year our production team was absolutely emphatic that that was going to be the last virtual gala that we were ever going to do. Here we are, nevertheless, but the good news is, is that we have been able to do a global gala. So a big welcome to everyone in the United States, the United Kingdom, South Africa, Australia, and the rest of the world. <clears throat> I see that we have a Sandra Atherston from New Zealand. We have a Chris Kotzer from Zurich. Why don't you let us know where you're coming from tonight or viewing from? Just um, go into the chat and just type where you are right now. We have an amazing program planned to support our crucial mission of caring for orphans and vulnerable children in South Africa. I want to remind you that the silent auction is still live and it will be until 9.30. So get in there and bid on a variety of unique items and experiences. Multiple countries have participated in this auction. So find your country's items and bid away. Now just a quick note, um, if there is not a country restriction in the title of your auction item, it is open to the glo globe to bid on. Please bid from your phone and watch the gala from your computer and make sure that you have all participants checked or if you're South African, we'll say ticked. Um, before we begin, I would like to say a very big thank you to David Rappaport for his support always and for arranging tonight's entertainment for us. I want to thank Investec USA for being our lead sponsor for the ninth year now and you're going to love this for covering the costs of this event so that 100% of your donation is going to go straight to South Africa. And in addition to that, they have donated $20,000 to match your donation. So essentially, your donation will be doubled up until the next $20,000. Yay! <laughs> Thank you to our wonderful board for your support always, to our fabulous gala committee um, who have procured almost a hundred items for you to bid on and without whom I would not be able to do this gala. So thank you. But very, very importantly, I want to thank all of you. It has been a very difficult and unexpected year for all of us. But because of your generosity, we have been able to meet our commitment to every single orphan and vulnerable child that we support and many, many more. I wanted to really show you the impact of your donations and the impact of your generosity tonight. So we had a film crew visit the very children that you have supported so that we could bring their stories back to you. Thank you so much for your love, your generosity, your support. And now that's enough of speeches. Let's let the show begin. The most vulnerable become the most forgotten. My name is Rutato 
and this is my story. My parents died when I was only 10 years old. Then my grandmother took care of us until she passed away. At 16 years old, I became the head of the household. I had to drop out of school to look after my brother and sister. We were all hungry. They asked me, when are we gonna eat? We just didn't have any food. So I pretended to prepare their meal, stirring and stirring until they finally fell asleep. One morning, someone knocked on the door. I opened it and there was a lady. The worker works for Starfish. She said that she was here to help. I didn't know what to say. I felt like she was saving us. She started to bring us food every month and she even brought us school uniforms and arranged my paperwork so that our family could get a support grant. She's like our mother now. I know that she's there if we need anything. I'm so grateful that Starfish came into our lives. I honestly don't know what would have happened to us if they didn't. Now every night we have a real supper. We all go to school. We are not forgotten. I can be a kid again. Imagine a world where children no longer suffer. You are here tonight because you care. And because you care, we know you will give generously to the most vulnerable, our children. Please donate to Starfish so our children may have a brighter future. Thank you. Sherry. 
Child of Africa I am a child of Africa Young and wild and free I play on seas of sunny hope And feed of dusty dreams I am a child of Africa Young, bright and bold You will know me not by the color of my skin but by the brilliance of my future. You will know me not by the poverty of my needs, but by the wealth of my ends. I do not want your vision because I have dreams of my own. I dance my way to Disney and I ride on wings of change. Hi, Harry, coming in on the chat. Here I am. You thought you could shake me. Ah, I'm back. Remember that time when I said we're only going to be doing this once and once only? Uh, I was wrong. Oh, my gosh. Here we go. So thank you so, so much. Uh, again, another incredible song uh, from David Rappaport and all of those supporters. Um, just incredible what's getting done during this whole virtual era. I mean, this is my 60th event in, in, in 12 months in the virtual space. So I've gone blue for tonight, which I'm excited about, but I honestly don't know if I'll even remember how to use a microphone on stage when, when it happens. But when it does happen, I can't wait for all of you to be under one roof and we can all raise money together um, for the Starfish Great Hearts Gala once again, as we did in 2019, was it? Oh, who knows? Um, anyway, as many of you know, I'm Harry Sansa Alaya. Um, I will be your virtual host again tonight. Um, I'm going to be guiding you through what different donations can mean for Starfish and um, who's donating at which levels. There's a fair amount to manage, sort of bits and pieces flying in. Um, I've got a live feed here. We also have the chat box, which is absolutely alive and kicking right now, uh, which is fantastic. But for those of you who haven't seen the chat feature, um, you have to hit the chat box, but don't forget that you have to choose all participants slash attendees. Um, why not just let me know where you're tuning in from? Um, you know, if you make a donation, let us know who it's in honor of, I'm sure. 
Um, you know, there's going to be people tuning in from all over the place. And I will do my best to give you a shout out. Um, the other bit of housekeeping before we actually jump into the appeal itself is that there is the QR code in the top left hand corner. Um, so that is the QR code. You just need to scan the QR code. That's going to take you straight to the donation page. Um, and as Nicola has rightly pointed out, we're already at $73,000, um, which is absolutely incredible. It's absolutely amazing to see this donations coming in. Um, so scan the QR code and that will take you straight to the donation page or pick up your phone. Um, if you're not scanning the QR code and you're unfamiliar with what a QR code is, um, by the way, where have you been for the past 12 months? Um, if you don't know what a QR code is, just enter www.starfishgreatheartsgala.org. It's on the top of the totalizer there. There really is no reason to get this wrong. Um, again, the, the QR code is on the left-hand side of that screen on the totalizer. Um, and hopefully people should be seeing that totalizer now. Can we confirm that? Um, we can see the totalizer right now, Candice, before I get going. Um, just fire it into the WhatsApp. I just want to make sure we're all on the same page as we get going in, because I can see David has uh, suggested where the QR code is. It might be that your chat feature is actually over the top of the QR code in the top left. Um, I'm told we're live and kicking. We're ready to go. We're at over $74,000, which is fantastic. But I am going to start us off this evening just with a gentle reminder that 200,000 children were supported in 190 communities. Um, that's how many kids are being supported in 190 communities. Uh, so think about them as you make your donations. Um, we also heard earlier tonight um, that incredibly for the ninth year in a row, um, Invest at USA has actually donated $25,000 as the, the um, head sponsor of the event. So every single dollar is going to go straight to Starfish Great Hearts. So that's covering the cost of the event. They've also offered $20,000 for the first 20,000 that come in. So give as much as you possibly can and let's double that money. Um, so let's get it going. At $30,000 is where I'm actually going to start off because I have a very, very special announcement. Um, we actually, with $30,000, you can actually support a whole wellness wagon, which are obviously one of the things that Starfish is famous for. Um, the incredible wellness wagons are making a huge difference across um, 190 communities in South Africa. Um, and by, by donating $30,000, you can support outright a whole wellness wagon so that Starfish can get out on the road and help do all of the uh, COVID-19 screenings, the HIV testing, the TB screening, and deliver food boxes, all of the things that the wellness wagons are, um, are so famous for and so popular for. Um, but I, I want to make a special announcement because Actually, there has been a $30,000 donation from Heather Johnson, um, who is, of course, a board member. Um, and that $30,000 donation has been made in loving memory of her husband, Jim Johnson, who absolutely loved the country and children of South Africa, of course. And through his generosity, um, Jim had a profound, a very profound impact on the lives of orphans and the vulnerable children. Um, so um, a huge shout out to Heather Johnson and of course our thoughts are with you um, and there will be a wellness wagon actually named after Jim Johnson on the back of this donation so that's $30,000 right off the bat which is absolutely incredible um, which has obviously taken us well over the $100,000 mark um, but again, thank you so, so much, Heather. Um, again, fire up that chat. I want to feel where you're coming from. Let me know where you're watching. Um, I've, got, I've got a live feed from Candice herself. Um, let me know where you're tuning in from and uh, make a donation. We're looking for 
participation. Um, we're looking for 100% participation, not just one person at um, you know who, who's watching uh, at a time. I want to I want to hear from each and every one of you, even if it's sort of 20, 20, and then a hundred thousand from one big spender in the corner. So everyone does their bit. Um, we are now at the, I'm sorry, I'm getting my live feed here from Candice as well. So that's at the $30,000. Um, at $30,000 is a wellness wagon, of course. Um, and we, for the ninth year at $25,000, Investec have made an incredibly generous donation to make sure that every single dollar that's raised tonight is going directly to you. Um, and, and sorry, to the Starfish Great Hearts Foundation. So at $10,000, um, Starfish is actually lining up again. Some more pretty exciting news. They are lining up to assist the clinics and the Department of Health um, with the vaccine rollout when it's actually ready. So, if you think about the logistics behind all of that, um, the wellness wagons are incredibly well positioned to support the um, to support the 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 rollout of the vaccines when they are ready. I'm not saying that's happening right now. But it is incredibly exciting news, and it means that Starfish is having an absolutely game-changing impact over in South Africa. The Wellness Wagons themselves or the mobile clinics are in the unique position to have access to super remote and, and sort of underserved communities in South Africa. And so they're able to assist with this process, and many organizations aren't actually able to be that far-reaching. Um, that's also as well as the education required for communities surrounding the vaccine itself. So that's at $10,000. So at $10,000, why don't you help us as and when we need to? Um, um, where are we at at the moment? We've got the well, wellness wagon. We've got Yassim uh, coming in. It's, it's still a, oh, I'm told we're at a hundred person limit, which means that we've, over, we've, we've actually gone over the 100 person limit, uh, which is what it is. I mean, it's, other, it's too popular apparently, um, but we must carry on. The show must go on at $10,000. Um, again, that will help with the rollout of the vaccine as of when it's ready. And at $5,000, you will feed 1,000 children with warm, nutritious meals. So during the pandemic, South Africa, of course, went into lockdown as did much of the rest of the world. Schools closed and with that, it meant that the only meal um, for the day for many of the kids was taken away from them. So the wagons mobilized and began delivering food, hampers to the children in remote areas. Some of it life-saving, life-changing certainly. So. Due to unemployment, hunger has actually increased dramatically and food security remains a heightened priority for starfish during this time. So a huge shout out to everyone who's able to, uh, to pr provide a $5,000 donation, which is gonna feed a thousand children uh, warm and nutritious food. Um, right, where are we at now so far? Let's have a quick skim back to the totalizer. Okay, right, we are at $112,000, which is absolutely fantastic. And Nicola, yes, the Wellness Wagon is doing such critical work, providing healthcare, education. It's gonna be right there on the front lines, assisting during the vaccination rollout, which is obviously doing incredibly well um, <clears throat> over here in the US and the results are, are looking very positive. So. The sooner we can get it over to South Africa, the wellness wagons and starfish will be ready to assist. Absolutely. So we're now at the $2,500 level. I just want to give some shout out to the board members who are tuned in right now as well. Um, again, let me know where you're tuning in from. I'm seeing a, a lot of buzz in the chat feature. Let me know. Um, I'd love to just sort of get a feel from you know, it's kind of the, the, the silver lining to the sort of virtual cloud as we can have people tuning in from all over the world. And of course, this is indeed a global event tonight, which is fantastic. At $2,500, you will feed 500 children warm and nutritious meals. So with the COVID-19 lockdown, as I mentioned earlier, the starvation has increased, okay? So the lockdown has increased the starvation and, you know, particularly in remote areas, 
um, area, a lot of the kids not being able to go to school and so on. So we need to get the meals to the kids themselves. And at $2,500, we've actually had a donation from Lee Perlman and Linda Reifberg, Reifberg, Reifberg. It's one of the two. Let me know in the chat feature. Apologies if I butcher anyone's name, by the way. It happens to me the whole time uh, with a ridiculous name like Santolaya. I can forgive people. Uh, so Linda and Lee, thank you so much. Honoring uh, David Rappaport, I'm here, I'm, I'm told here. So that's at $2,500. Literally changing the lives of 500 children with the press of a button. That's absolutely incredible. Again, let's go over to the totalizer. We're at $117,000. Keep it coming. Let's go. Pete Bennett doing his bit. Joan Gilman, Carolyn Hurst, Nicola, of course. David, thank you so, so much. Um, we've got some. Antonio, thank you very much for your incredibly generous donation. Um, someone called Anonymous, which is a quite ridiculous name. Um, anyway, so Lee Perlman, thank you so much. And Linda, Tanya, everyone is doing their bit right now. Um, so a big shout out to all the board members and everyone who's, who are coming in strong. We're at $126,000. Do you hear that, New York? 126 thousand dollars let's keep it going let's get to 150 grand why not let's keep the push on okay a thousand dollars let's get down to a thousand dollars who can just give at a thousand dollars um think of the impact that i could have it could have you know that could be 40 children's school uniforms shoes blazers and a school bag um, these are supplies that a lot of us probably took for granted as youngsters they they're life-changing things uh, for the kids in South Africa, a lot of them, children aren't even allowed to go to various schools without school uniforms. So sometimes it's the uniform itself that's preventing kids from having the education they need to progress their life. Think about that. Think about that. It's just the uniform that's holding some of these kids back. Provide that uniform. Give $1,000. I promise you, it will feel fantastic. It will tap in to that altruistic element that's inside each and every one of us. Make sure you pull that trigger. Let's get that thousand dollars in. Don't forget the 100% of the first 20 grand from now um, is gonna be matched by Invest Invest USA. So you're more or less doubling your money. Can you imagine if you could invest right now and overnight it could blossom 100% return? That's what we're offering. Um, so keep those donations coming in. Let's see where we're at at the totalizer. $134,000. Come on, let's just go big. Someone also a shout out uh, to Christy Gordon. Um, uh, we've got donations coming in from all over the place. Bradley, thank you very much uh, for getting involved. Again, where is everyone tuning in from? Is no one listening? Hello? Where are you tuning in from? Put it in the chat feature. I want to know. Give me a shout out. Candice, let me know where people are tuning in from. I want to know. This is, uh, I don't want to feel lonely here in, here in Brooklyn. Um, okay, right. So onwards and upwards. We've actually got, there we go, the first place. We've got people from Singapore. We've got Zurich. Fantastic. This is a global event, don't forget. We've got a ton of people tuning in from New York. We've got people tuned in apparently from New Zealand. Um, from Dubai. Incredible news, by the way, today coming out of New Zealand, which is fantastic uh, to see. Um, if only the world was led uh, um, by the, the system in New Zealand. So we've got Dubai, New Zealand, Zurich, Singapore, New Jersey, Connecticut, uh, New York. We've got all over more or less the, 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 uh, the East Coast here. Do we have anyone on the West Coast of America? Let me know where you're tuning in from. We're at $136,000. Keep those donate. A family of four sitting together watching in Washington, D.C., the capital of this great nation, the land of the free and the home of the brave. Thank you. We've got Raleigh, North Carolina, the Hudson Valley, which is where I was once looking for a house, but have been hideously priced out of the market as people sort of scurried up north of the city. Uh, we've got people tuning in from Rye, New York. Thank you so much. Washington as well. Um, this is so cool. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is fantastic. 
I love seeing how you guys are tuning in and making such a difference. Don't forget, you're not just here for the chat feature though. I want to get to $150,000. We're so close. By the way, the sooner we hit that 150 grand, the sooner you can crack on with the rest of your night. Now, I'm just going to shed some light on a few of the lot items as well. Uh, we've, of course, by the way, got some people tuned in from uh, South Africa as well. Um, quick shout out. Whilst we're on the subject of South Africa, there is an incredible, incredible VIP, incredible, exclusive, luxurious trip to South Africa, which is worth over $6,000. And that, when you go on to the website, is the VIP tickets tab. It's on the left-hand side. Only 100 tickets will be sold at $250, okay? So your odds are very high of winning that item, okay? And if you bought 10 at $2,500, your odds are extremely high. Only 47 have been purchased so far. So your odds are even higher than 100 to one. So go and purchase a few of those tickets. Again, the trip is absolutely incredible. Just top line stuff. You've got six nights in South Africa. Highlight, um, it's gonna be a six night experience for two people. You'll arrive in Joburg, spend a night in a luxury suite and at uh, 10 uh, Bompus Design Hotel. You'll enjoy complimentary breakfast in an incredibly tranquil garden setting that you'll experience a, a big five safari, of course. You can't not go on a beautiful big five safari um, in the South African bush with three nights at the luxurious Thorny Bush Game Lodge. Um, you will also spend two nights at the Samara Game Lodge. I mean, it's an incredible, incredible trip. It is also valid. Most importantly, listen out here until December 2022. So you've got plenty of time to deal, uh, to, to make sure that we're sort of able to travel and so on. We've made the most of that, buy some of those tickets and get involved with that. There's also an incredible Howarth Wines um, selection, a case of wine that sold at, well, nearly $4,000 last time we did it. Um, and it should go for much, much more. I know that. So Perry Boyle is somewhat of a wine connoisseur and has a wine estate in Argentina. This wine is not available to the public. And so it can only be obtained by Perry um, if, if, if it's gifted. That's it. So this is the last case we will be getting to auction off for this. So I want to see this go for above and beyond. Dig, dig deep to win that lot item. You've got jer signed jerseys uh, from, from the uh, 20 world, from the beast, no less, uh, the South African prop uh, known as the beast. I'm not gonna even attempt uh, 10 days second name, uh, but I was there in Japan. I watched him sadly destroy uh, the, U the, the English team in the World Cup final. I flew all the way to Japan, didn't even cross my mind that we would lose. And sure enough, we got absolutely humiliated by South Africa. Um, goodness me, whilst I've been talking, we're at $142,000. Keep those donations flooding in. Once we hit 150, we are good to go. But there's a few more live items or all times I do want to bring attention to. Um, so by the way, the signed jerseys are lot, items number 11 and 12. Uh, number nine is the wines, the case of wines. And again, the tickets are their own separate tab. Now, um, a really awesome item is item 18, 53 and 75. Um, so Bakithi um, Kumalo um, has musical instruments that have been, um, that are being auctioned off. They're signed by the multi Grammy award winner, uh, Bakithi himself. So Bakithi was actually born in South Africa. It was too, too, poor to even afford instruments. So he actually made them out of a can and tubing to teach himself how to play, which is just blows my mind, this story. And his dream was to be able to bring music to impoverished children in South Africa and music saved him. Um, and that's why he wants to be able to do the same for other children. Um, he now creates um, singular electronic fretless bass sounds um, and he's now a multi Grammy award winning basis, which is incredible. So um, the final item that I want to give a shout out to, we're at 100, nearly $143,000. Um, 
The final item I want to give a shout out to is, of course, James Delaney's elephant and calf piece, which is going to be hotly contested. Number four. Okay, right. That is enough from me. I don't want to outstay my welcome. Let's get to $150,000. We're very, very close, ladies and gentlemen. So many generous donations. Quite right. Rosa Chang, who is, comment uh, who is commentating on that as well. Keep those donations coming in. The, uh, the, the VIP trip, I'm, I'm, I'm told, will be announced on the 26th. So that is, of course, tomorrow. Um, again, I've been Harry Santolaya. I really am praying we will all be together under one roof um, next year. I'm going to give just a few more uh, shout outs as well. They can, um, everyone can join, um, um, join in and bid. You've got the uh, Bradley Foster is a board member as well. So a big shout out to Bradley. Thank you so, so much. Um, before I leave, let's just pop over one last time to see where we're at in that totalizer. I believe we're at nearly 145 grand, which is absolutely incredible. Um, 143, so, so close. Keep it going. Keep those donations coming in. It will be live for the rest of the evening, at least. Um, the song Jerusalem uh, went viral during the coronavirus pandemic. I'm sure many of you saw it, even participated in this viral activity. Um, so it went viral because the, of the dance challenge, of course. Well, I'm not going to even try because I can't dance. Um, but it enacted a simple way to connect and build community, which is kind of what we're trying, what this is all about, really, especially at a time when people were hungering for these types of possibilities and avenues to connect with one another. So the children that you have helped have done their version of the um, of Jerusalem, Jerusalem, um, in celebration of all of your generosity and all of your commitments tonight, the donations, the silent auctions, the matches from Investec USA and and so, so much more. So all of the hard work that went in behind the scenes. Um, so that is what they have committed to you um, in celebration of your generosity and how your donations have impacted their lives. So enjoy this video.
Ladies and gentlemen, I am Sebastian Walker, the US board chair for Starfish. This is our second virtual gala in a row after what happened in 2020. I hope everybody is staying safe and sound. We look forward to welcoming you in person in New York for our 2022 gala. Thank you to Candice, to the board and to our phenomenal gala committee for all the support over the last 15 months and particularly for helping make tonight a huge success. 2020 was an extremely challenging year for Starfish. Our CBOs were closed on the ground and our donors struggled to give the amount of support that they had given in 2019. Despite this, we knew we could not falter with our support for the children back in South Africa. We continued to support the same number of children as we did in 2019. And as a result, no child was left hungry. Our focus for 2021 is to continue to support the children that we did in 2020. And we ask all of you to please give generously to help us grow and maintain the presence that we've had in South Africa to date and support the number of children that we've supported for the last many years. Thank you so much and have a wonderful evening. With your help, Starfish can ensure that vulnerable children are provided with food, COVID-19 medical care, education and protection from violence. Please donate now. Help us help them.
Support Starfish today and help get the wellness wagons delivering to those in need, because no child should have to go to bed hungry. Every day is so wonderful and suddenly Get insecure from all the pain. I'm so ashamed. I am beautiful no matter what they say. Words can't bring me down. I am beautiful in every single way. Yes, words can't bring me down So don't you bring me down today To all your friends Thank you so much everyone for your kindness and your generosity. You have absolutely blown us away tonight and over 11,000 children will be helped and many lives saved because of what you have done tonight. Thank you to our fabulous Broadway performers. You did an incredible job yet again. Did you notice the Imagine song? Not one instrument in that song. Everything was done completely using voices. Great job to all of you, Yasmin, Maya, David, Eric, Madison, Brad, you were fantastic. Thank you, Harry, for doing a great job again tonight. Thank you to my partners in crime, Nicola Atherston, Eleanor Middleton from Starfish UK, Mpo Sidibe from Starfish South Africa for helping us to bring this global event together. Before we close, just a quick reminder that the Safari Prize will be drawn um, the 26th, our auction closes at 9.30, so you still have time to get some of those lovely goodies. So bid high, but often, but most importantly, have fun. And now it has come to the time when we will play our anthem. Thank you to the late Johnny Clegg for doing this for Starfish. I know that you will enjoy it. Be well, be safe, 
Good night and thank you. Strange behavior Every man has to be his own savior I know I can make it on my own if I try But I'm searching for a great heart to stand me by Underneath the African sky Van sterren wat skyn in die hemel En die wind vluister sachies haar liekie dier die graas There's the rolling thunder across the savanna A hope and dream at the edge of the sky And your life is a story like the wind Your life is a story like the wind I'm searching for the spirit of the great heart To hold and keep me by One day, thoughts on the song and I see something Got every clothes, so what's the commotion? Throwing that starfish back in the ocean Getting it back in the water in time Cause out of the water they surely would die There are way too many, she replied One starfish at a time